everybody and welcome back to another video. Today's video is a apartment speed build. I haven't done an apartment in a while so I thought this would be a perfect opportunity to do one because I haven't done one in a while. But this apartment is where Penny Pizzazz lives. She had like a lofty apartment and I made it into a two bedroom one bath. The master bedroom shares a door with the bathroom. Yes, the master bedroom shares a door with the bathroom. And uh, there's a door to that little hallway that is connected to the bathroom also. But yeah, I add a uh, laundry area to this build. And I put um the laundry hamper in the bathroom, but I don't understand is why the uh laundry thing says there's no washing machine available. I do not understand that, and if y'all will leave it down in the comments below if it be in this video or uh, comment on the gallery where I uploaded this build and tell me why because I would love to know because it's just frustrating but I like the look of it anyways I left it in there yep I put a mirror butt splash in the kitchen which looked very good because I just couldn't this wasn't liking the tiles this time around for the kitchen so I was like I'll put mirror butt splashes and that looked good and um here I am trying to figure out how to do the laundry area and uh, I end up having the washer and dryer side by side and a little matching counter that matches the living, I mean not living room, but kitchen, I think. And uh, in the little laundry area. And I put curtains on the laundry area opening because I pictured it like you could open and close it as you like and if you had visitors over you could uh, close it up so they couldn't see your laundry <laughs> that'd be great to have in the apartment if you had an open laundry area like that so that's what I was thinking Anyway, uh, there is a, I thought I was doing just city living and base game and laundry, but I added a pet bowl and a pet bed, so you'll need, um, what's that pack? Cats and dogs, and there's a, like these uh, stair not stairs um chairs it runs the stairs hey the chairs in the kids room the little the teenage boys room that I made look like a nail shaped couch so you'll need that back too but you don't need it it can be replaced with anything your heart desires but yeah that's um what i did and i don't believe me raising up those mirrors you can i don't believe the sims can use those mirrors but i like the look of them and i couldn't find a city of living mirror so i was like what am i going to do oh i know yeah, that's what I was thinking anyway. Um, here I'm working on the teenager boys room. 
I had all this stuff underneath the bed knowing that Sims have a hard time getting in bed if you put stuff under the bed in a certain spot but I couldn't remember the certain spot so you'll see me player testing this at the end of the video. Well not the very end because I have screenshots but before the screenshots you'll see me player testing this apartment and I just moved a few things and deleted a few things and then it worked perfectly and I, I had to add the closet kind of on was into the wall a lot <laughs> in the bed, master bedroom as you will see in the player test because the Sam decided she couldn't get to the other shot, so I could have added the the bed onto against the wall, but I thought I don't want it against the wall. I know they can scoot over on the bed, but in the sense four anyway, in the sense three they couldn't, so that's a plus. They can do that in the sense four. But I didn't want to do that. I wanted to the bed in the middle of that space. And I did a James Turner here to Sensify. Thank you, by the way, to Sensify if you're watching this. For this idea, I used those signs as a headboard. And I put the bed into... I left the headboard. Of course, you have to leave the headboard. That comes with it, but it hides that, and it looks awesome, by the way. And, yeah, I just go with the darker frame for that. And I used shells and sized them up for the nightstands. I thought that looked pretty good, too. Anyway, um... I'm kind of running out of things to say. There was a few pauses in this video. I was actually watching a live stream. And someone had a question. So I typed, answered the question. And that is the pauses. And I apologize for those. But hey, you gotta do it. You gotta do it. No, but... If somebody has a question, you gotta answer it, right? Right. Anyway, I did a dance floor into the, uh, kids' room, the teenager's room, which adds another pack, which is good together, but, yeah, that is, I believe, all the packs. And, yeah, um, I'm fixing the player test it. But I'm also running out of things to say, so I'll leave y'all guys off here. If y'all would, like this video and comment down below. And subscribe if you haven't and hit that little bell icon beside the, the, the subscribe button to get notified for the next video. And... I love y'all and see y'all in the next video. Bye everyone.